up everybody it's absolutely frost here and in this tutorial i'll be showing you how to get windows 8.1 for free um but um but but you must have i think windows vista and up to do this update um if i'm correct or really it doesn't really matter um if you get the um well see i'll i'll put this uh this link in the uh, description. So if you're running like Windows XP or something, you want to jump right to 8.1. Well, then you have to download the ISO file. Scroll down. Ba -da -ba -ba. See ISO files here. Um, you need to copy this product key. You can copy that. Download your your version, your language, and your architecture. So for me, it'd be like English 64-bit. And I would download that, and then you could. And then once once your ISO is downloaded, you will need to go and burn it with either Windows Image Burn or whatever it's called, or you could get Image Burn, which is a really nice software to burn uh, files to copy files off a CD or something and read and stuff like that, verify, and it's it's a really nice tool. So you would do image file to disk you would go and choose your your ISO file and then you would click this button here uh, make sure that you have a uh, burnable uh, DVD in your drive um, so um, if you want to do it the easy way um, you'll probably have Windows 8 um, now what you're gonna do you're gonna download uh, here this file Oh, excuse me. Oh, get the update, and so that'll download a file right here. Now I already have it. So once it's done, you're gonna click it. It's gonna open up. It's gonna be a simple installer. It's gonna ask you. Um, it's gonna ask you for like your credentials and everything, and it'll. It'll be like a five minute little install type of thing. And so once that's done, your computer will, will reboot and it's going to um it's gonna boot into uh Windows eight point one installation. Now this installation isn't like any other installation. Um it it's well not for if you're upgrading from Windows eight to eight point one. If you're doing like a like Windows 7 to 8.1 with the ISO, then it'll be like a full installer. Like you boot up the CD, you'll see like the whole installer and stuff like that. But um, for for just upgrading Windows 8 to 8.1, um, you won't have to click anything. You just leave your computer alone. It will install. It's gonna take for me. It took about t it took about two hours. And now after that, um, see, so yeah, you need to. Give your computer some time, so go and grab a coffee, go watch a movie or something, come back. And it should be finished by then. So you really don't have to do anything once once your computer has rebooted. Um, then once that whole process is finished, your computer will reboot again. Or I think it will. And um, you'll be greeted with the Windows 8 start screen. Or the Windows 8.1 start screen. Uh, for me, I had to reboot like twice to get the whole start screen, all, all my applications to render. Oh yeah, I'm just saying, uh, if you're upgrading Windows 8 to 8.1 with this type of technique, well, um, you're not going to lose any of your softwares or files. It will, it, it will not format your hard drive. So that's pretty nice. So, um, so yeah, I had to reboot twice for some reason to like, get my whole start menu to render. Now what, now... Now you might ask yourself, well, what are the features in Windows 8.1? Well, there are many features, but the most common one that, that, that people really, really like is the Start Menu button. Now, that that got take, uh, taken away in uh, Windows 8, but now it's back in Windows 8.1. Um, there are many other features, but I won't get into it, um, because I'm sure that you can go and find other videos on YouTube on how to get um, your uh, Windows 8. Uh, your, your your information on Windows 8.1 and uh, excuse me um so yeah I think that's pretty much it and uh, I mean it still has a few bugs 
because um, it is a preview, it's beta, and I think it comes out late this year, late 2013, so um, it should be out, like the, the, the final should be out, the final version. Um, Windows 8.1 is also called Windows Blue, for your information. Um, so, if you're walking on the street and you hear people saying, oh my gosh, I love Windows 8, uh, Windows Blue, well, you'll know that, that they're talking about Windows 8.1. Um, so, that's pretty much it for t how to get Windows 8.1 preview. And, sorry, I couldn't get a screen recording of this because... Um, because I can't run my screen recorder while I'm installing an operating system physically on the machine. But if I were to do it in in a uh, virtual machine, then I could. But I don't think I'll do that because I'm just going to waste my time. Um, and as you can see through this whole video, I have not really clicked or installed anything. Um, that's because I already did it all. And everything's fully functional right now. So, um... So that's pretty much it. Thank you for watching and have a great day. Bye.